lastly, to finish up this lecture, let's look at the second use of power series that I mentioned, which is an application for estimations. Okay, so the easiest way to see this is, again, just an example. So, example. Use the first three terms of the power series expansion. Our representation around zero of one over one plus x to the seven to estimate the following integral integral from zero to one tenth of one over one plus x to the seven dx. Okay, so I'm just going to run straight into the solution. How do we do this? There are more examples in the notes that you can test yourself on. So let's just run through the solution. This integral, 1 over 1 plus x to the 7 dx is equal to, remember this expansion is only valid for absolute value of x less than 1, but that's exactly in, that interval contains the interval we're integrating over. So this is equal to, sum minus 1 to the n x to the 7 n dx, which now is roughly equal to, and we're just going to take the first three terms, because if we think about it, after this, so the first three terms are 1 minus x to the 7 plus x to the 14. The next term would be x to the 21, and for x close to 0, that's very small. So let's just do the integration, so we ignore the small terms. Okay. And if we plug in these values, if we plug in the limits, it's roughly 0 0.1. Okay, so this integral would have been very difficult to do by itself by just finding an antiderivative and evaluating, but now we have approximated it well enough by just using the first three terms in the power series representation around zero. So that's a lot simpler. It's one method for applying power series representations in a useful way.